Okay. Oh, this is Cuphead. <laughs> this is Cuphead. Yeah, they did make Cuphead, didn't they? They, they helped, I think. Uh, this is my game of the year. This is actually your game of the year. This is my game of the year. This is the game that has meant the most to me this year. This is Outer Wilds. It is a small-scale, handcrafted space exploration game. And it's just the bee's knees. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna resume expedition right where Blair was. Yeah. Because I don't remember what I've done. Uh -huh. I've translated some walls. Yeah. Went into some. There's a lot of walls. walls. Where's your copy of this game? Uh, it's on PC, and that would just be oh, too much of a hassle. Yeah. yeah. Capturing my PC is a little. Is a little oh, cool. Wonky. I haven't seen anything on this one. Yeah. So I'm excited. Yeah. So Outer Wilds is about. Let's see if. Oh, oh yeah, I'm gonna wake up. Step X. You might. Outer Wilds is a might have to switch your inver inverted settings. Oh! At least he said might to soften the blow. Yeah. <laughs> oh god! Even ship look was inverted. Do I want ship look? Should be inverted. That's how ships yeah, yeah, work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I actually agreed. Okay. Oh, okay. Gosh. Oh. oh I just gotta move my stick into the. <laughs> ship look should be inverted. That's how ah, ships fuck. look. Ah, fuck. <laughs> okay. Eat that much. So, I am an alien. I'm on this world. Uh, it's called Timber Hearth. Yep. It's a really powerful death trap. Yeah. I'm gonna go into space. Uh, is this massively multiplayer and online? No. No. Okay. Surprisingly, no. It's just no. your own little thing? This game, so this is my ship. It's, it's nice and rickety. Look, it's all held together with twine and, twine and duct tape. Somehow we have anti-gravity. Put on my spacesuit, and I'm going to buckle up, and we're going to go to space. Oh yeah, dude. Do you have homes on other planets? There are other planets. Okay. I wouldn't Just call the them Earth, my home. Actually. Hmm. So you know, Blair has already explored. Blair has explored uh, Brittle Hollow. I'm going to go find the twins. Yeah, there we go. So autopilot. How do I do autopilot? There, up on the D-pad. So, this game is about uh, exploring and solving a mystery. In the first run of this game, you realize that in 22 minutes the sun's going to explode. However, you get put back in time 22 minutes every single time. Oh, I'm gonna run into I'm gonna run into Ash Twin if I do. do So then, you're just not really in any danger? You're... There, there's danger. Every time what happens, time goes back? The every time, every every time, time the, the sun explodes or yeah. you die. Every time the sun engulfs. I think I actually did want to uninvert the ship controls, but it's fine. Oh, you played it uninvert. Oh my god. Uh, let, me, let me just figure out where I'm trying to land here. Uh, I've, I also haven't played this game in a little bit, so I'm a little rusty on... Yeah, the ship controls definitely it, take a little bit of getting used to. It's bobbly and finicky in a, in, a, in a very tactile way. Yeah. It becomes super intuitive later on. It does, yeah. It kind of becomes second nature, but... Yeah, at first you're like, oh my god. Okay, I'm going to set her down real gentle. I guess this is how a fucking rickety-ass ship would control, huh? Uh, so you're trying to solve a mystery, and every time you learn something... Mm -hmm. Blair, you must have never used this. Probably did. Your didn't. information board populates a little bit with just. It points you to places. Like the Quantum Moon and the Know My Minds and the Ash Twin Project. So I'm gonna exit into here. Let's see. Where am I right now? I need to go towards the equator, because that's where. So on this planet. These planets are paired, and sand is slowly flowing from that planet onto this planet, into the core. Huh. And over the course of the 22-minute cycle, this planet's slowly going to fill up. Oh, no. I'm being dumped on. That's my... That's my... That's my... Oh, booster. Okay. I'm going to boost my way into these caves. Uh, let's see. Where is the way to go? Right now it seems like a non-random no man's sky. Yes. Yeah. Okay. That's kind of the vibe. Okay. So this planet is filling up with sand? Yes. Is that a good thing? Oh, unidentified signal nearby. Hmm. Where's my radio? How do I how do I pull my radio out? A signal scope. Oh hey, one of my buddies is here. 
All your buddies play musical instruments. And that lets you track them down a little bit easier. Like, actually buddies, or...? Yeah, these are other explorers from your space program. Oh, what's that? Yeah, he's up here. Yeah. Here's my friend, his chert. He's playing the drums. <laughs> First launch of a well, yeah, what are you up to? Yeah. It is one of the best places to spot astronomical events. Couple supernova, yep. Let's see. Where should I explore here? A little scout, yep. Yep, the old shipwreck. I should go to the old shipwreck. Don't I'd love to see the old shipwreck. Just saying hi. <laughs> okay, so to the south. Let's see, this is the North Pole. My ship is... My sh oh, my How can you there. tell where the equator is? What? You got a little... Yeah, I've got the planet map, so that red oh, is one I of them. Oh, I see. And I catch that over there. Yes. Yeah, let me, let me find let me find the abandoned Nomai ship. Ooh, ooh. You can totally fling yourself off of the planet. You can, yeah. It's actually pretty easy to... <laughs> yeah, it's terrifying. <laughs> like, out of the field of gravity? Yep. Yeah. Like, right. Yeah, it's not like Mario Galaxy, where it's like, everything is affected by, like, gravity in the way where it's... It, it makes sense scientifically, in, in a very like twee way. Yeah. So well, let me let me find that let me find that shipwreck, and then we can launch a Nomai probe and maybe learn some more. We'll learn something. Let's see. That's the station. There's the shipwreck. Okay. Let's set her down, real gentle. So this game is about unraveling a mystery as to why the universe, why the sun is exploding every 22 minutes. And you learn a whole lot about this ancient alien culture throughout that process. Um, so I haven't played this game. Uh -huh. Can I make a hot take on what the mystery actually is? What's the mystery? Sometimes things just happen. What the hell? Status report. Everything unharmed. Escape pods passengers are, unafra are afraid. No distress signals. Yep, there are some other signals. So you slowly learn that this alien race got scattered, and you see as they begin to work and like operate in the in these environments that they are slowly figuring out how to deal with this world and investigating things on their own. Enormous cavern. Okay. Mark directions. Okay, yeah, gotta hurry, because the pathway's gonna be covered in sand. Yeah, no, this place fills up pretty quick. Let's see here. Aha. Right. Somewhat convoluted, so, so follow the instructions. Yeah. Every tw 22 minutes, the sun blows up. Yep. And you're reset. Yes. Yeah. So this happens to this planet. It fills up with sand every uh -huh. 22 minutes. Every 22 minutes. How do you make progress? Do uh, they just let you keep you your learn more, data? You learn more, and learning is actually one of the most powerful things in this game. To the room for what you learn and what you like find here stays. Okay. So, so you... Okay. It you is yeah, you slowly build up, so like you don't have to keep going to the same place. So like. It's not like you have to do everything you need to do in 22 minutes. So is the like idea the that you are a new alien the next time you come here? No. Learning no, from you're the same. You, oh, okay. Your memories are transplanted into... Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. It's like Groundhog Day. Have you beaten it? Yes. Okay. I have. Yeah, there's there's an end to this story. Is it a good end? Oh. It, it seems like it would have a good end. <laughs> I don't... I. I don't want to say that much because I desperately want you guys to play it as well. Okay. How long did it take you to beat it? Uh, it took me about 20 hours. Okay. Cool. Cautious crosses. Yep. Be cautious. I'll look for the tunnel. Hidden behind the falling sand. Okay. Yep. Uh -huh. <laughs> A little farther. Hurry. Okay. These cactuses are bad. How so? They look spooky. They hurt you, and they poke a hole in your suit, which lets air out. Okay. Here we go. Ooh. That's the sauce. This entire game has the feeling of being an alien archaeologist, like <laughs> stumbling upon the remains of an old civilization, 
Like yeah. this is this was the primary this is the primary structure in this in this planet civilization. You can turn all the lights on. Oh, oh come on. What do you think the quickest speed run of this game is? Uh, I could do a speed run in twenty two minutes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you can you do, can beat the game in twenty two minutes. I would hope so from a time travel game. Yeah. Like if you yourself knows everything you should be able to beat it in twenty. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, no, this is a dead civilization. There's a mystery as to why everyone died that involves this ghost matter. So I'm gonna put my scout launcher out. Launch my scout out, and let's see, I take a snapshot. So these crystals mean that there's a ghost. I'm, I've, I've got a lot of games with ghosts. Ghosts again, yeah. yeah uh huh. Yeah, it sounds like 2019 was Eric's Year of the Ghost. You're, you're the Spook Inspector. You're a lot of ghost the Spook and the Spectre. Caleb's was Year of the Switch. Yep. Mine's Year of the Gun. Yep. Mine was Year of the Beat. <laughs> the oh. Let's see, can I... I've got to zoop that back in. Let's see, can I see a ghost in here? I think there's a little ghost in there. Just a little ghost. Yep. Ghost. As a treat. Ghost matter. Yeah, yeah. All that Ooh. green stuff—that's ghosts. Uh, what happens if you if you touch the ghost, you die huh. instantly? Pretty much. Yeah, the ghosts don't fuck around. So they're mean ghosts. It's ghost matter. It's a it's a specific anomaly to this universe that you learn exactly what the ghost matter came from, and it's terrifying. It's like a cosmic horror story in the middle of this game. Ooh. Did it come from other ghosts? Dude. Uh, Obviously. Uh, it it's came the ghost <laughs> of a ghost. It came from someplace. A ghost's ghost. That's the most powerful ghost. Yeah. Double ghost. It's like, don't fuck with a ghost's wraith. It's true. What's this path? I forget. Oh. Oh no. Oh yeah, the sand's oh, filling up. Sand. Uh -oh. Yep. I'm, I'm almost out of oxygen. This game does the space claustrophobia really well as well. <laughs> I'm yeah. feeling it. <laughs> yeah, I, I got really uncomfortable while I was playing it. In like a good way. Like the planet that's like just a constant fucking ocean storm. Uh huh. That planet freaked my shit. Oh, I hate that being underwater. Sounds like something you wouldn't like. Yeah, uh -huh. I I hate that shit. And there's a point where like my ship just got taken away by it, Which and I was like, I have nothing left stone. to do but energy be lab. in this water. High energy lab. Oh yeah, I can't go to the high energy lab. Uh yeah, I'm gonna get out of here. What's gonna... your timer? Uh, there's no timer active. You just need to like know or have a timer in real life. Oh, also, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, but it also kind of scared the shit out of me the first time it happened. Uh huh. Because it it happened at a very precarious time. What the end? Yeah. Because yeah, it happens. It, it's like it's like every 22 minutes Majora's Mask happens. That's yeah. what I was just about to like segue uh, into. Is 100%. It's, it's, it's like got, Majora's Mask compacted into 22 minutes. It's got big. Skull Kid energy. You're always yeah. witnessing the end of the world and trying to make progress towards. Oh yeah, I yeah. remember this place. I'm pretty sure there's a ghost right here. Might be a ghost right here. I don't know. Maybe there's not a ghost directly there. I think there's a ghost over there. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. there's, there's a ghost on that side. So I can. So really, it's on the right wall. I can step there. Oh no. So it's like under where I can he get was, around. I, think. I can get around. Yeah. Okay. Oh, here we go. Yeah, and then eventually, so the way this, this game works is that, oh, there's a little hole right here that gets me like right into the city. So if I just need to find this thing, and then I can immediately get into the city and like do more research earlier. Yeah. Mm. So that's the way that this whole thing develops. Is the idea is like, yeah. Get there quicker. Finding yeah. shortcuts and uh -huh. remembering what you've already known. And, yes. Yeah. Okay. It's incredibly intriguing. Let me get back to my ship. And then I, I'm going to show off a little bit of... Should I go to Dark Bramble or should I go to Ash Twin? Are, aren't we I'm on Ash Twin? We're on Ember Twin right now. I think I've seen a little uh, bit of Ash Twin. Okay, yeah, I'm going to go to Dark Bramble. I don't know what Dark Bramble is. Yeah. Dark, Bramble is the, Dark Bramble is the scariest shit in this game. Love show it. it. Okay. And refuel. Buckle up. Okay, let's see here. Where, so how do can I get you to fly the... into the sun? Oh yeah, probably. Yeah, you can. <laughs> Don't worry, I tried. <laughs> okay, did you just die. How do yeah. I pull up okay. the map? 
No, that's the down camera. Where is Dark Bramble? Is that Dark Bramble? Could be. How many planets are there? Too many to uh, count on your hands? No, no, there's... There's Dark Bramble, there is Giant's Deep over there, there is Brittle Hollow over there, uh, the two twins, and Timber Hearth. Oh, okay. I think that's Dark Bramble. That's the yep. cool, yeah, that's the cool thing about this game is that it's... It's compact. Yeah, yeah. It's it's surprisingly small for being kind of big. Uh -huh. like, yeah. There's a lot to unpack in it, but it's all very... It's, it's all crafted, which is cool. Another thing I could show off if I... If I get lucky, is the quantum moon. The quantum moon? There's a there's a moon. It's quantum. <laughs> yeah, this game deals a lot with quantum mechanics and like real heavy sci-fi shit. Uh huh. It's. Uh, yeah, I don't think. Let me see. Who yeah. dark rainbow with you? Okay. Well, uh, hold up. One second. No. Oh. I think I might actually. Okay. This is dark bramble. Oh. Uh, uh, I turned off my autopilot. I think this one's exclusive too, because I'm trying to find it on Steam, and it says Ooh, TBD. Shit. shit. Uh, oh, it's uh, you have to get it on the Epic Store on PC. Yeah. Oh, how much? What's a uh, retail? Um, I think this is also like a fifteen dollar guy. That's not bad. Okay, I need to repair my ship real quick. Yeah, I, I would recommend if you're if you're rocking a PC, I would recommend getting an Epic account. Just it's free, and there's a lot of really good games uh, on it. Fuck. Okay. And uh, shit. every Shit well, for the last ass. twelve days, oh, no. guys. Oh god. Oh no. Did you fall out of your ship? I I the ship. I need to repair the ship real quick. Oh, it fell. Is it not available on PS4? I feel like it is. Yeah, my thrusters were damaged. Yep. I'll repair. Uh, but the Epic Store constantly has like free games you can just get. Yeah. Hmm. Every two weeks they give you two of them, I believe. Um, and then right now, since it's around Christmas, they had a thing where like every every day for twelve days it gave you a different one. Dang, that's nice. Oh, yeah, it's pretty great. Air tank is fucking. Yeah, that's no good. Oh god. Oh, god. God, this. Ugh. Oh no. The <laughs> ship just fell. <laughs> I I I turned off autopilot to try to look for the quantum moon. Oh. Nice. And I got a little. It crashed. I got a, yeah. It, it stopped firing my retro rockets a little bit too fast. Okay. Okay. Let's investigate Dark Bramble. So Dark Bramble is a... It's bigger on the inside than it is on the outside. What? I hate it. Okay. Oh, my upper hull's damaged. That's fine. As long as I don't find any fish. Fish? Oh, no. That's an option here? Yeah. The fish only... The fish can only listen. They can't They can't chase. It is bigger on the inside than the outside. Yeah, weird. Uh-huh. Yeah. Some dark, house of leaves shit. Dark Bramble is... It really is. Holy shit. The, the first way you learn about Dark Bramble is if you investigate on your own home planet, you find a seed that has sprouted, and if you fire your probe into it, it shows up as coordinates having on Dark Bramble. So this is like a dimensional plant that has like eaten other worlds. What the fuck? Oh god, yeah, even this little like tiny acorn is huge. <laughs> uh, <laughs> That's cool. Okay, well, let me get my signal scope out. Oh, oh, I might be able to find. Oh, it's the name of the game. Yeah, no. One of my one of my buddies might be over here. It sounds like he plays the harmonica. <laughs> <laughs> You found the bard. Duck in there? What the fuck? Oh. Oh, he's in there. Oh no, this is this is one of the this Wait. is one of the plants that's on my world. So if I fire a probe into here, it's duplicated the signal. It's in there and it's also over here. So, so there's just a guy on your world playing a harmonica right now that you can. No, hear? no, no. It's this is my I'm I'm trying to find my buddy and he posted up next to one of these to like get a better chance of being found. Oh. Yeah, because the greatest explorer of my planet ended up in this ended up in this place. Oh. Oh yeah, both of my both of my scout probes are right there. Oh, okay. 
Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Anglerfish? Yep, that is that is a corpse, and okay. my homie is here somewhere. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh god. Now you're there, somewhere. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna. Okay, velocity's been matched. I'm gonna get out. Oh, match velocity. Uh, yep. Refuel. Open that. Oh no. <laughs> every time, every single time. <laughs> Your hull is damaged too. Yeah, it's fine. I'm gonna go. Oh yeah, that's my buddy. Actually, him or just a signal? Uh, that's him. That's him, all right. Oh uh, yeah. That's feldspar. Whoa. Whoa. Second hard thing to ever reach it. Yep. <laughs> you all thought you were dead for sure. <laughs> Not in this lifetime, little buddy. <laughs> Aren't you the greatest pilot in Harthian history? <laughs> yeah, he made it to the core of the sea planet, which I was stumped on for the longest time. <laughs> Cruising around, yep. Pulled a few stunts, nothing too fancy. Crash blammo. I can't believe you didn't die. <laughs> mm, yeah, you can ask a lot of questions. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna spoil anything. Okay. But this Is guy this, knows, this guy gives you hints about a whole lot of like deep mysteries in the world. Huh. What were you gonna ask, Blair? Like, is this place supposed to be? more towards the end. It seemed or, like it would have been hard to find. Yeah. Yeah. With the you, signal finding matching this and all guy, that You can shit. find this guy pretty easily. Though. Like, you can start out knowing the radio signals for all the, like, Outer Wilds ventures. Okay. Mm -hmm. So if you follow the radio signals, you can get to most of these guys, and they give you cool hints about, like, lesser-known stuff to do in these situations. Okay. Oh, oh. Can the world end on this planet? Oh, yeah, I think so. Okay, because you I'm just asking because you're in pretty deep, dimensionally speaking. Uh-huh. But I guess... Yeah, uh, no. If the outside gets fucked, the inside will get fucked. Indeed. Where's my ship? Up there. Yeah, I probably should have found a Landed way to... It. I probably should have stayed outside so we can see the universe end. But we'll know when it's happening. Yeah. We'll know when it's happening. You're just in a teeny-verse right Where, now. Where's my... Where's that hull breach? Where's that pesky little hull breach? It's the aft hull. Is that... Is Oh, yeah, that's the end of the world music. Uh-oh. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I don't think there is a good way for me to get the fuck out of here. Let's see, Outer <laughs> This Wilds might be where it ends. Outer Wilds Ventures. In a mini-verse. So that's, that's him. I wonder if I can find a path out using the second signal. You've gone through so many little things, like... It, uh, is um, it even possible to get out of here? I don't even remember how many little fucking weird <laughs> yeah. I think holes you went in. Technically three deep? I think so. Oh no, oh god. Me too. Oh. It's been so long. There's an inner wall. That's Hopefully good, just follow the wall. Fish. I want to uh, see a fish. I'll well, we'll see if we can find a fish for you, Blair. They seem spooky. Are they, they as big as the dead one you were Oh in? yeah. Okay. Yeah, I want to see a fish too. <laughs> Fucking right. Fuck I might be able to find Fuck the eggs. Up. I might be able to find the eggs. Oh wait. Oh, that's Felspar's ship. Hmm. But I think the world's gonna end. Yeah, and too that might late. Be, that might be. Yep. That sounds maybe like in the world. next lifetime. It's gonna reach us last because we're at the edge of the galaxy. This is a very quiet game about not being able to do anything until you suddenly can, <laughs> and learning about how things fall apart. It's a story about scientific hubris. Oh, oh, hello. Uh, just like that. Yeah. And I don't, I, I've been stepping around because I don't want to talk too much about this game, because the joy of this is about the exploration and about 
how deep the mystery runs. Yes, uh, you you legitimately end up filling up a cork board full of in, in that little <laughs> ship in that little ship computer yeah. of all the different things that you can investigate, and it pays off in one of the most satisfying like sci-fi storylines that I've heard in a very long time. Okay, yeah, and every yeah. time you wake up right here, you wake up right here. You wake up right here? here, and you see that explosion, yeah. and I know what that is now. It's part of the mystery. Yeah. Well, can't you just go to where that explosion is? Oh yeah. Do you want me to go there? Yeah. <laughs> real quick, just real quick. Well, yeah, yeah, that was only twenty-two minutes. You got time. Yeah. My interest is peaked. Real quick. I'm also absolutely going home and buying this game. Real yeah, me, quick. me too. Well, you got me one. Let's just put that on. Let me just buckle up. Are you going to play it right when we get home as well? No, it's probably going to be my bedtime by the time oh, we get fuck. home. But I'm going to play it? it tomorrow. Shit, it's already night. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go to Giants of Deep and I'm going to go investigate that at their station. Is that where the explosion was? Yes. <sighs> Giants of Deep is the, is the terrible ocean planet that's, that's scary and bad. It's also where some of the game's coolest mysteries live. Oh, yep, right there. Right there. Is that on the planet or kind of floating around it? That's a that's a station, my friend. Oh. Born autopilot. Yeah, the game plays with perspective really crazily, too. Like, just how, like, they all look so tiny until you get there, and then you're like, oh, damn! Oh, shit. This planet looks tiny. Yeah. Okay. That's the station. Hello, no. Oh, that's super cool that, like, when you're on the wrong side of the, uh -huh, the planet, dark. like, you just can't see it. Oh, fuck. <laughs> fuck. God, I really did play it with the uh, non-inverted. You can change it. It's in the fucking thing. Okay. No, I'm, I'm gonna have to go in and change them back anyways. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm synced up with... I'm synced up right now. I'm just gonna... Okay. Oh, wait, no, that's a landing pad. So if I can... If I can go like this... Match velocity. How do you match velocity? Uh, if you the... if you link up with the ship and then you it's just A to match velocity of whatever you're targeting. Okay. Oh. Okay, yeah, and then I just gotta Nicely done. And then that should be Oh, you turned off the headlights. Yeah. Okay, down the hatch. Okay. <laughs> All the alien tech in this game is so fucking neat. Yeah. Ah, uh, so what do we have here? We have yep, the launch module. That appears to be that appears to be in a, in a state. I can't quite get there. Huh? Wonder where that is. Uh, that's uh, probe tracking module. That's. Ugh, well. <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, gone. Uh, what's up here? Is this... I, I'm pretty sure the crew quarters still exist. Control module. Yeah, that still exists. Yeah, all the... I, all the, like, spacesuit controls feel fiddly in exactly the way you want them to. It's really yeah. wonderful. Okay, here we go. They've invented anti-grav technology. Okay, yeah. Launch module projection stone. Let's project. Let's you see a different place. Yeah, so where is this right now? Okay, yeah, this is just floating off somewhere. Okay, what about this? Okay, giant's deep. Put that down over there. Let's investigate the ship workshop. Yeah, this is down on the planet. Hmm. And this, on this okay. planet, there are giant storms that pick up islands and throw them into space. Jesus. Oh. Yeah, it's terrifying. Yeah, this, this planet fucking freaks my shit. Uh-huh. This is the first planet I died on. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's buck wild. Uh, let me just, just last little tidbits here. Hook up AOL Instant Messenger here. 
bad news. There's a problem with the power source, so the cannon won't be asked to fire. Hope you're pulling my locomotive limb here. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of good translation humor. <laughs> I wish I were my friend, but no. Indefinite hiatus. Return to the cannon. My spells now will remain at the construction yard. Yep. Privet has left to visit her brother. Mm -hmm. Feels responsible. Yeah, Outer Wilds. It's a great game. Ooh, I'm gonna go up here. Ooh. There's more anti-gravity. I'll walk on the seal. Ooh, I forgot about this. Ooh, come on. Yeah, it certainly seems cool. Hey, come on, come on. Let me... Ugh. Feed me the pigskin. <laughs> Farve it over there. Oh, no, get back here. Get back here. D guy, guy, guy gotta dunk you into this hole. Who's a guy gotta dunk over here? Yeah. Whoa, what's going on here? A little projection technology. <laughs> I know what all of this is. Dump that in there. Yup. Yup. Was that the space station? Is that good? Uh-huh. Uh, not anymore, it's not good. Oh, hey. Probe launch successful. Saving data. Structure's compromised. Yep. Don't worry about that. That seems fine. Oh god, did they launch a nuke into the sun? No, they launched a probe out to look for something. I don't know what, though. Well, I thought you said you unraveled all these mysteries. Oh, I I have. He well, knows then, what. He knows what. Know you what. just said you don't know what. Oh, some damage. Oh, viewport window's fractured. Missing. The tracking model's missing. Uh-oh. Yeah, this is Outer Wilds. I don't want to reveal any more, but Very you, guys, you guys should play this game. Yeah, I will. I'm going to. Yeah. I will play it one day. My definite game of the year and one of the best sci-fi stories I've ever heard. Nice. Ah, thanks for so bringing the endorsement. Alrighty.